So I'm Joe. <laughs> That's Sarah. That, <laughs> Let's try that one again. That's Boof. <laughs> Lee. <laughs> Together the Lee Boof. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome to Cincinnati. We jumped in the car, traveled about two hours to come up here and visit our family. So Holly at the Photo Museum recommended this place here to us. It is a female artist that took all the photos. I'm not sure how well they'll turn out because it is a little bit of dark up there. But these photos were amazing. They were all... We read the description. What was she trying to capture? Uh, uh, Cuban, Appalachian heritage, and African American heritage with uh, reusable material like rubber tires that seemed to kind of be her go to item. Um, there was one with a Lego uh, string necklace. I mean, it so was she was trying to recreate traditional, traditional cultural items with, with repurposed. Material. Materials. So like stuff you'd see in a landfill. It was absolutely awesome. The photo focus that's located at the Cincinnati Shakespeare Company. Thank you Holly for recommending that we visit this one. It was amazing. We accidentally tripped upon this photo focus um, movement that's going on in Cincinnati walking through one of the parks and we are completely enthralled now. Washington Park. <laughs> um, we've seen three different exhibits and from what I understood there was over 30, 400. Oh, 66 locations yeah, 66. in Cincinnati and over 400 artists artists participated in these art exhibits that are located all over the city. It's really neat. It is absolutely amazing. The first one that we walked through, um, I know we got some footage of it, was an outdoor exhibit in a large inflatable tent. Bubble in a giant bubble. And it was a sound exhibit and the, you opened the boxes inside this exhibit and you could see the vibrations of the sound in the strings surrounding the boxes. Than me explaining it, but it was really cool to see. And then of course that second exhibit uh, that Holly explained to us Spot on. Make sure I get you in there on that. Okay, thank you. Holly Sprawl, Gallery Director at Wash Park Art. Fantastic. So like the artist has yeah. a description in there on how he came up with this installation of the pictures on the floor and he was like, well, I wanted to kind of capture the, the eBay-esque kind of mentality that people have towards their photos and they just kind of, they're just left, that everybody takes these photos and they're just left in people have boxes of them and nobody oh. ever sees them. And you find them at like thrift yeah. stores. Yeah, and you can just find them for pennies, yeah. Yeah. for pennies on the dollar, you know, and yeah. their memories and they're, they're just all over the place and nobody has any care for them. And then you, you walk into this room and you see them all on the floor yeah. and you're like, wow, you don't want to walk on them, you don't want to oh, step yeah. on them. Well, yeah. I was very hesitant to step on them. It was yeah. uncomfortable to feel like I was going to step on somebody. Yeah, you're going to break something. Somebody at one point held that deer and then it was just on the ground and it was just interesting. And Man, that's pleading. the point he wanted to make. Yeah. He was like, you have these memories. and I mean, a lot of those pictures were what, developed in the 40s, 50s. Yeah. I mean, you're talking about 70, one person in them. Yeah. And, they're, and they're on the floor on the to floor. walk on, to step on, to get shuffled around. And it was, that makes sure you want to, you know, take care of your own photos. Mm -hmm. I mean, but that, I mean, that is the great thing about digital culture. That is one of the good things because, I mean, with the vlog and the camera and stuff, people are taking way more photos. Yeah, I there's mean, more of history that's captured now than ever was. In a, in a day, mm -hmm. in one day, there's more pictures and yeah. video taken than you know ten years ago. Yeah, it just brings it right, right to you. You know, um, when you see something like that, you're like, wow, that's. Deep. I like that. Was awesome. That was awesome to see. I'm drawn to this gentleman over here. He looks like my grandfather, and I'm just like, wow. Right. I, well, that's the other thing. That's so weird that I'm just, I, I'm like, I, I know I'm reminiscences. You know, when you look at it, like, there's poses that add into it. Yeah. Everybody has a little bit of their family photo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Or their pizza. Like, you know, like, 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 this looks like Jennifer Brewer. Jennifer, is this you? It's a likeness of her. 
Holy smokes. Let me get that to zoom in on her. We need to get her to get that hair though. Oh yeah, Jennifer, you gotta get this haircut. That does look like her. On the back it says Maud Allen. But I saw it from a distance on the floor and I thought it looked like it looks like Jennifer. That's crazy. It's the eyes, I think. Yeah. Jennifer, your photo's here. How cool is We're at uh, Cove's uh, Conservatory. Crone Conservatory. Crone Conservatory. Crone Conservatory. Part of the Cincinnati Parks. Joe and Sarah are just taking us to all these cool, cool places today. My goodness, we are having a blast. We've been through the Pokey Park. We've been through the Eat You Alive Park. We've been through the bonsai trees. It's pretty cool. And the cacti. The Pokey Park. Park park. Oh, sorry. Sorry, that's the Pokey Park. Like, like anybody out there didn't know that that was the Pokey Park. They might have not known. They might have not known. So we are- some interesting Pokies. We did. <laughs> oh. We're in the Pokey Park. Yeah. <laughs> I got band-aids. The what part are we in, sir? Pokey Park. <laughs> Have <laughs> you ever been in a pokey? Uh, I didn't realize it was open to the public. <laughs> the pokey part, that is. There's pokies in there. And I keep finding them. I'm going to need another band aid. I did not notice the Vegas sun. <laughs> the what? The Vegas sun. Oh, I see it now. I see it now. I'm like, what? Um, I don't mean to. I mean to keep this PG, but as I was coming down to the pokey, look what my viewfinder stopped on. Well, that's a. Uh, that's. It's a cactus. Yeah, a cacti. I don't, I don't see anything. It's a cactus. Yeah. It's a cactus. It's very fuzzy looking. Yeah, it's very. A lot of. Lot of white fuzzy stuff on yeah, the, the almost erupting with white fuzziness yeah, yeah. it's interesting i don't see anything wrong with it no. i don't know what you're talking about <laughs> looks just like a plant to me this one does look kind of like a yeah like a plant we smelled some beautiful flowers and Joe and Sarah's favorite part was the. You might want to wait a second. I don't know what they're doing. Yeah. yeah, this is actually one of the cooler ones. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was coming. <laughs> uh, Joe and Sarah's favorite part was the cacti. No, the succulents. Cacti. Yeah, same difference. Pokey part. Yeah. The pokey part. <laughs> and so far, I've liked the bonsais. Too. I'm torn between the carnivorous section. Carnivorous, yeah. Carnivorous? Yes. Carnivorous. I like carnivorous. 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 I like carnivorous. Kind of nervous. She like likes the carnivorous yeah. part. <laughs> kind of nervous about the carnivorous part. <laughs> I like that part. <laughs> we can edit that out. No, Not likely. Yeah. 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 It's most likely going to stay in there. And I guess there's a waterfall at the end. There is a waterfall. There's a waterfall, a waterfall in the center part. In the middle. Yeah, yeah. that we have evidently was 23 minutes. To get yeah, we got about yeah. 23 minutes. Yeah, there's the tropical section next, and then there's another section even after that. So let's go. Several wonderful weeks there was. Several wonderful weeks there was. Just one because, because, Well, I'm guessing that's what that guy is there on the side on this chocolate tree. Yeah, the pots are the chocolate pots. And Holy! Pots of delicious. Yes. 
How in the heck has somebody not walked off with that? It's too much work to make it, so it's easier just to leave it and have somebody else do it. And just go buy a Hershey's bar at the store? Yeah, it's cheaper. Like, okay. there's like <gasps> fuzzy pink oh, plant. Oh, look at that dude. Oh, he's so cute. He's got a little caterpillar plant. He's so yeah, and fuzzy. All, all up these in there. fuzzy pink plants. So we really recorded a lot at the at the hockey game, don't you think, Jay? Oh, definitely. And rather than show you the game, we thought we'd do something a little different. We'll just show you the parts that were the best. So this is our collection of some of the best parts of the game. In other words, it's where people slammed into the wall a lot. Over and over again. This is one sport I can get into. Now there was never a dull moment because even in between the periods, there was action. There was the Zamboni baby. The Zamboni. Work two hour drive down. Yeah, definitely. Even with that crap traffic. <laughs> I'm gonna drive one of those, so that's what I need in my life. getting the tickets, taking care of it, and getting us as close to the ring as possible. We loved it. And we will catch you guys next time. And of course, we'll bring you along at our next game. Bye guys. Bye. Toodles.